represents like a very big web that is surrounding the whole globe. And I find it extremely interesting, attractive and fascinating that one gets to, one has connect, cultural connection uh, so strongly to Austria and through Austria around the world. So I just see it as like a beautiful net uh, around the world. Yeah, for us concrete, it uh, meant actually quite a few tours. Unfortunately, it was the Corona times, so we had, uh, or the organizers had to cancel some of them. But for us, Nazan program is really, I would say, really uh, gave us some nice uh, tours, I would say, opportunities to see cities. We didn't play with a place we probably would not. So it's, I think it's a very, very good uh, uh, organization. It gives so much to us uh, musicians. Yes, I, we could answer. Oh, so yeah, many so many times. times. So, even though we are the COVID group, so we, must, <laughs> we, we didn't manage to really uh, travel. Most of our travels that we were looking forward to were cancelled. We still managed to get in some amazing travels. But I think we would not so soon see uh, uh, Japan, actually, if it uh, wouldn't be for NASA. I think Japan it was, was really one of the... We would probably not see Palestine either. We were in Israel. Oh, so true. Yes. It was absolutely gorgeous. Then we were in Macedonia. Uh, that was a very, very nice experience. And I think also what is what is very spe special that we find with with this with this program is that you not only visit the country and you play and uh, in these places, but they also sometimes organize master classes. Mm -hmm. You are very much in touch with the public, and because you come there as a guest of the embassy or the cultural forum that exists in that country. You, are, you immediately have this bridge of uh, a person, an, an ambassador, who, uh, who has been there already and who knows some things already. So we're there already being introduced into a very insider environment. And that makes it very special, for sure. It's not just another visit on tour. Yeah, yeah you know, exactly. You, you learn things about places that you would just otherwise not. Mm -hmm. And you get to know wonderful diplomats that, that are working for this country. That has been also very special. We met some very special diplomats working for, for Austria. So I think I, all in general it is a great project and a great opportunity for a band like us to visit um, places around the world and, and play and visit a lot of uh, people. Actually now we recorded a couple of videos for, for many countries around the world uh, and actually visited two. The first one last year uh, was Slovenia, we played in Copa and this year we played in Montenegro. Every opportunity to play uh, is is really good for 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 a musician and a band in general, and this, especially if you have the opportunity to uh, go somewhere where you don't play usually. Maybe an opportunity to play concerts out of Austria. It's nice to be chosen and to, to meet other, other bands. And it was for us maybe also a starting point to, to start new projects. Um, here in Austria we did kind of few things the last two years. And yeah, now maybe it's uh, there is enough the chance to 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 um, perform it. Uh, it's a, a good thing to get connected with 
different musicians from all over the world. Mm -hmm. You can use the connections for other projects. It's it's just nice to be in this in this um, conglomeration of musicians and um, yeah. And we, we did some projects and yeah projects with um, other people who are not with NASOM and they kind of supporting this too. So we had the chance to um, play with Manu Maya and NASOM also supported it as as a group of, group of five people. So it's it's nice that they're open to new projects, new collaborations. The NASAM program is a great possibility to bring a music in international areas, in abroad concerts, international concerts, and they support us and a lot of young other musicians and bands, and this means a lot for us. Or Maxi? Yes. Yes. And Nikki? Yes. <laughs> yeah, we had the opportunity to go to different countries already. We've been to Belgium, to Turkey, Istanbul, to Paris, Bratislava, Germany. Germany. So we we could bring our music to other countries and help those countries in the cultural dialogue with Austria. And it has been a great opportunity for us so far. And hopefully it will last a lifetime. <laughs> Optimist says you are, you are a pessimist calling me, calling me. Yeah. Optimist says you are, you are a pessimist. Uh, it means a lot to us because actually NASOM or let's say Austin Music Export, they were like our first partners who were supporting us uh, playing abroad. We were, I think our first show was in Tel Aviv, in, in Israel, and it was quite exciting for us because it was the first time that we got an airplane as a band, and it was a really, really great experience for us. Those circumstances, especially for newcomer artists, you don't get paid a lot of money, which means that we are really like um, depending on every every cent that we get. So New Austin South Music and Austin Music Export are really, really great partners who can support us and can support a lot of newcomer artists. I think that like for me personally, um, I think one great experience was that we got to play in, in Istanbul. That was really, really great because also um, someone got like, uh, got like, uh, like someone noticed us playing there and she was like writing us on Instagram, she can make a small documentary about our stay in, in Istanbul. That was really, really amazing. So. It like Nasom also helps us to connect with some other, um, how to say, like some other artists. Not not us, not especially from the music side, but also from the video production side. And that was really really a great experience for us. <laughs>